Hi, I'm Dana, and I thought I would show people today how to stitch with um, Superior's Glitter Thread. It's a Mylar kind of material, and I'm using a Baby Lock Regalia ST. It's um, probably a 2023 version of that machine. I just had it uh, gifted to me by my husband last month, uh, February of 2024. So I think it's a pretty recent model and um, bought this at my local Baby Lock dealer. I don't know if you can see, you probably can. Um, it's really glittery thread and this is it. I have it on the horizontal spool pin and I'm trying to show you, I can't even see what I'm filming right now, but you see you bypass that tensioner, only go through one hole of the three vertical ones and make sure you go through your discs, through your pigtail, and then um, thread as usual for your, for your needle. I'm using a 16 needle and I've got a 50 weight superior so fine in the bobbin. And I have done all of this quilting so far without breaks um, in, the, in the thread. And that's pretty unusual for me because all of my other baby lock machines do not like this thread at all. And one of the things that really attracted me to this machine was how well it handled specialty threads. I like to use a lot of specialty threads, metallics and glitter threads. And so this is like really fun for me. Um, so I just thought I would show how smoothly it does stitch with this thread. This demonstration is not at all for, you know, look how great I free motion quilt because I don't. I'm very much a novice. So here we go. My uh, bobbin tension is set at three, or I'm sorry, my upper thread tension is set at three. So that's a really, really low tension and you're gonna to wanna to turn off your tension alarm and your, your thread break alarm on your machine if you're gonna use this because the machine thinks that because your tension is so light that you've broken a thread or that you don't have any thread in it. So I didn't know that in the beginning, but my dealer, uh, Raymond Berger at Berger Selling Bath in Manassas, Virginia, educated me about that as he has so many things. Wonderful dealer, if you're in Northern Virginia, I can't recommend him highly enough. Um, the awesome tech too, I mean, he can spot something that's off with your machine from across the room practically. Um, so, but if you, if you see, I mean, I'm not stitching very quickly. This is all real time. And I'm not moving at any other speed other than what you see here. Um, so it is admittedly a little bit slow at 8.50. Um, I'm still getting used to sewing on this machine. And also, you know, I have the paranoia about this thread that my other machines have taught me. So I tend to treat it with kid gloves. Uh, but I think you can see that there's really no problem at all stitching with this. Um, it goes very, very smoothly, very nicely. I probably should turn this up for you. I don't know if turning the lights up any brighter will help so you can see the thread, but um, it's, it's pretty nice stuff. And I really, I like doing things with it. So I hope this helps anybody who is interested in sewing with this thread on, I guess, maybe any baby lock long arm, I, I guess. Um, I don't know, this is the only one I've ever had. So I don't have any frame of reference for the others. So have a good day.